Today we are going to talk about bullying. This is a very common thing these days, but some people still don't have a notion of the consequences that this act can cause in the lives of the victims. The term bullying comes from an English word bully and it means to threaten, intimidate. Bullying is an unwanted behavior, behavior among school children and it's characterized by aggressive physical or verbal uh, intentional repetitive attitudes that arise without any apparent motivation. Bullies are normally um, people who use their power, uh, such as physical strength or popularity, to control or harm others. And this act can be individual or in group. It serves to intimidate the other who doesn't have the ability to defend himself. The target is uh, children with certain particularities. They it can be uh, physical, cultural, religious, ethnic particularities, or it may also be a child with uh, special needs, or a novice, or a pretty girl being chased by the colleagues. Uh, children who are bullied can have serious and lasting problems. 40% of the children who, who, who are victims of bullying have never sought for help because they are so ashamed. Uh, they feel shame and, uh, and they feel fear. So they tend to, to keep silent. Some victims even uh, agree with the aggressors and others to show strong, to show that they are strong. Um, they can choose others that have more defenseless um, abilities. It can be more defenseless child. So they become aggressors and victims at the same time. Um, it's, it's very important to encourage um, a, a daily practice of dialogue. This is for the parents with the children. Because the, in order to, to realize if they are being victims of bullying or not. They have common signs, these children. Um, for instance, uh, low self-esteem. Or they can start to be become very afraid to go to school or feel uh, shame. Um, they may show lack of, of interests in uh, school um, activities, like in the studies, and they start to have low academic performance. So the, the parents need to be aware of these signs uh, if a teacher realizes that a situation in a classroom, the intervention must be immediate. Because uh, for, a, for a teacher, it's easy to identify who are the, the aggressors and who are the victims. And the school is responsible for any act of bullying uh, inside the, the school uh, establishment. Also, there are uh, some, some cultural values that need to be instilled in children, such as um, tolerance, solidarity, um, empathy, or um, respect for individual differences that need to be taught to, this, to the children in general. So, to deal with the consequences of bullying, or in case of doubt, the parents should ask for psychological help for their child. There are um, several types of bullying and several, several types of bullies. 
so stay tuned because in the next videos i'm going to develop this theme and go deeper into this topic hope you liked the video if you liked it uh, leave your like and subscribe to the channel activate the, activate the bell so you'll get notified every time i post uh, a new video and don't forget to share this video because it might be useful for some of your contacts. Okay, so I'll see you next week. Mm -hmm.